My name is Hadari Davis. I'm from Oakland, California. I'm the National Program Director for You Speaks. Today is yet another Life is Living Festival. Life is Living 2014. This is the, the mother of all, the home of Life is Living, is this park, the Firmary Park. It's where the festival started. And though it's traveled all around the country, we always bring it back here every year. Most Life is Livings, um, we try to be as intergenerational as possible. So we focus on activities that are centered uh, first and primarily on young people um, and make stages that center their experience and then try to enhance that with the voices of elders, of uh, celebrities, of other artists and activists in our community who can uh, perhaps give it more strength. Uh, I think of life as living as um, creation and forwarding and preserving of culture and that we, everything about art is culture. Our music is culture, visual art is culture. And so Life is Living is about transformation through culture. And for us, that's like really key. I describe it as a community development project that's done by a bunch of crazy artists and culture keepers who um, really want to preserve the culture of this West Oakland neighborhood and who really want to enliven it with different types of art and different kinds of activities and different kinds of methods and share it with people. I think Life is Living is really a convergence of the talent, the innovation, the artistry, the um, community dedication that really is the spirit of Oakland and Life is Living really puts that on a platform. It shines a light on what's here. Um, it's not just the new Oakland, it's definitely rooted in a lot of community resilience and celebrating life in one of the most historic parts of Oakland, Infirmary Park, Little Bobby Hutton Park, birthplace of the Black Panther Party. A lot of what we do in this festival is to consider the contribution that the Black Panther Party in particular has made to this community. A lot of the activities that we do, uh, like the free breakfast program, or like the open mics, or like having activists take the stage, a lot of that is based on that philosophy of the Panthers, that, that art and politics and culture, they're all one thing. To commemorate that wholly, we installed a, a, a Panther mural. Uh, essentially by having thousands of people tie ribbons on a mural in the shape of the logo of the Black Panther Party. And it's just a way that we felt like we could get community to actually contribute in something um, in, in collectivity that honors everyone's kind of experience and understanding of what the Panthers left for us here in West Oakland. It's like this beautiful exorcism for the community, for the park, a cleansing, a reunion. And I think people leave every year more inspired. Part of why this makes such an extraordinary event is the diversity of what's here. You know, there really aren't very many other cities, if any, where you could have this unique kind of array of complexity. Not just in terms of ethnicity, but in terms of age, in terms of gender, but particularly in terms of culture. You know, you have literally people here who are recent immigrants um, from other countries. You have recent immigrants from other cities. You have people who've been born and bred here. But for an actual festival to have this kind of diversity is unique. And that's something that really reflects the uniqueness of Oakland. Life is, Life is living. It means to live fully. To live in a space where you are expressing your best self. Living not in a small way, but as big as you possibly can. And there's so many things to be joyful about. There's so many things to inspire you and to motivate you and to help you to grow and evolve into the best self that you can be. Life is living is about living fully.